I'm going to give you a quick introduction on how to use FileWay. FileWay only needs to be used when you are not at school. So this is a good way to get documents to your H drive from home or get them from your H drive at home. But when you're here at school, you just go to your H drive and we'll kind of show you what that looks like. Okay, to access FileWay, you go to the East website and go to Students. And under Students, if you'll look kind of near the bottom, there's a FileWay link. If we click on FileWay, after clicking on FileWay, you will get to Home com. Now it's time to log in just like you would log in from home. So we're going to put in my username. Then we can tab to password or click on password and type in my password. And then click OK. Once I get into home.coppelisd.com, I should see two folders, one with my username on it and one with the S-Share. Okay? If I need to access a document that's in the S-Share, then I would double-click on S-Share and go into there. If I want to access something from my H drive, I look for my username. So if I double-click, it will open up my H drive. To just view a document and look at it, you can double-click on that document and a new box is going to pop up. If you want to actually work on the document, then there's a completely different set of things you need to do. Once you're in your H drive at home from FileWay, you click on the document that you would like to open. Just click on it one time so that it's highlighted in blue. Then we're going to go up here to the top and you're going to see some icons. Okay? This icon is an upload icon. Notice the arrow pointing up. This is if you want to put a document from your home computer onto your H drive so you can see it at school. Next door to that is a download document. That means you're going to download it from your H drive in FileWay to your home computer so that you can edit it. You cannot edit anything unless you download it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on the download and a file download box is going to pop up. I'm going to click on save and I'm going to choose where to save it. For me, the easiest thing to do is download onto my desktop so it's easy to find it later when I want to upload it back into my H drive. So I'll click on save and then close. Now I need to shrink file way because I don't need it anymore right now because I'm gonna go and work on my projects so I'm gonna click on my down and I'm gonna find the project I saved I'm gonna double click and I'm gonna open it up now I'm on my home computer working on the project that I needed to complete once PowerPoint opens up I'm gonna make a change okay so I'm gonna take this fourth page and I'm going to turn it black just so you guys can see the difference okay so now I have one two three and then fourth one's black so what I'm going to do is I'm going to save it at home I can file save as PowerPoint I'm going to put it back on my desktop and I'm going to hit save Okay, now that I've saved the document, I can close it out. And again, I'm still on my home computer. Here is my document right here on my desktop that I need to upload back into FileWay so that when I get to school, the changes are there. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to go back to my FileWay. I've completed all the changes. So now what I'm going to do is I'm going to upload it and I'm going to like kind of save over top of this old one. So I'm going to go over here to my icon that says Upload. I'm going to click on the button. I'm going to get an upload file. Then I'm going to select what I want to upload. And again, I'm going to pick that exact same file with the exact same name and click Open. Now it's in there. I just click the Upload button. So now it's uploading. Upload is complete. So now what I've done is I've taken this form right here 
and then I have uploaded it and changed it with all the changes that I made at home. So again, I clicked on the thing and I downloaded it. I saved it to my desktop here. I made changes at home. I saved it. These are now my new this is not my new document with changes. I go back to Fileway and I upload it so that it takes the place of this old one. And then now I'm going to go to the H drive and I'm going to see if it's there and if the changes are there. Okay? So am I at school? I'm not going to access Fileway when I get to school. Now it's time to close out Fileway and I'm going to go to school and find it on my H drive. Okay, now I'm at school. I go to the start button. I go to my computer and I click on H drive. When I do that, my H drive pops up. Here I have all my files and everything that was in Fileway, but now you notice everything looks different because it's in the H drive at school. So here's my um, document that I was working on. So if I double click and open it, now I'll notice that slide number four is black just like I had done at home and uploaded to Fileway. Okay, now let's look at the difference. This is my H drive at school. I'm able to see the folders in yellow and all my documents underneath. This is my H drive in Fileway. I see little tiny folders with more archaic, I guess, W's. This is the H drive that I access from home, and this is where I can upload and download. This is my H drive where I can just get to my documents right at school and I can just save them inside of the H drive. There's no upload and downloading at school. I only upload and download at home. So here I am at home. I upload and download documents to work from my H drive. When I'm at school, I'm in this H drive and I can just save. There's no uploading and downloading. I hope this has helped with the confusion of Fileway. Fileway is a place to access documents when you are at home. When you come to school, you don't need to access Fileway anymore. You just go straight to your H drive.